and we are about to get underway here if you join us for the first time on wheelchair rugby league it's it's rugby league but in a wheelchair the thrills spills the skills all on show six tackles to make a tackle you've got to remove the tag off the shirt as England have the ball here, England starting on the front foot. Can they get some early points as they attack down their left-hand side? They knew Lier makes the tackle, but they're going straight up. And it could be a chance for Halliwell. Oh, look he's gone over. He's taken the points with it. But this try about to be given, and England have struck first. Perfect start indeed, Mark. And it came off the back of the ill-discipline from the French side. As you said, the wheelchair was not square when they restarted play. That's given England the field position and the opportunity. And Halliwell there, great use of the hips. I thought I was watching Shake and Stevens there. Keeping away from would-be tacklers. The upper body strength on show there as a drive just to calm things down for France, who now move it out wide. Dana Williams trying to go on the outside. He's going he's for the line. He's, over. he's going for the line. He thinks he's got France's first try of the afternoon. England are there, but they didn't make the tackle. I think they knew Willie Air fancied a, a rerun of his opening try there. And they're going to go to him again. He's going to try and power his way in. He slips the ball. He tried to pass it. Quick play of the ball. Classel gets over. into the corner. Yep. A wonderful skill. England may be distracted by the fact that the player was down and out of his chair. But France didn't switch off. And it is that man again, Nicola Classel. It's on again. Just settles things down for France uh, almost setting up play here they're going for the Here drop go. goal and they yeah. get the drop goal Jules Clarcel drops the goal from right in front and maybe that's a sign of how tight France think this game is going to be he's right play France best we've seen from France now they go again Clarcel he's going to weave he's his way score. in that's it's brilliant. a simple simple try oh what about the celebration from one of the best players in the world of wheelchair rugby league Nicola Clarcel he dropped a goal a minute ago and now he's under the post with a try that opens up a big advantage for the world champions yeah fantastic play from Nicholas Clasell you know I've watched him closely in this game Mark and he certainly seems to be the architect of a lot of good play for the French side looking to add the penalty here and extend the lead to 15 points forward he comes sends it on the way such judges don't need to move that's as a ball now with Busson. Busson weaving his way forward. He's going to outpace oh, the defence. Yes. Oh, He's going to outpace the defence. And that was far too easy for the French. Busson just spotted a gap. And not for the first time, England caught on heels defensively. Yeah, absolutely. And, you know, England head coach Tom Coy will not be pleased. For England now, great opportunity. They have, but can they turn it into points as Halliwell drops it back? Now they've got bodies. They've got Four on Collins it's over. In. Slides his way over. Nathan Collins, treble winner with Leeds, player of the match in the grand final. And that's why he weaved his way through. England finally had the numbers, and Collins executes. England had to score next. They have scored next. Oh, it really is end-to-end -end and the the speed the intensity is going up here now Bashara Bashara right, right off line. Away. Coy cuts back in oh. fires it to Halliwell Halliwell oh. side from the line Halliwell oh. the captain paces forward he's oh. tackled the meter short and it's tackle. that man again Basson a try saving tackle oh. I thought England were going to score another miraculous try but oh. Basson had other ideas wonderful defense from the French but England now just starting to show what they can do as the ball now goes to King chance here right Collins is in and England have got back to back tries in the second half they are now back within two scores and England denied by a wonderful piece of defense have the patience to get over Collins is in his second of the game France 27 England 16 big big set incoming for England a try gets them back within one score just over a quarter of the game remaining Games between these two are generally tight affairs. Ball down the short side. Collins jumps oh. under one. Collins it's goes for the lane. Yes. He's over. It's over. Collins with a hat trick oh. in the second half. And England are alive and kicking. Oh. They're now back within five. A quarter of the game left. And it's that man. He won the treble with Leeds. And now he's got a 
treble for England. Oh, what about Nathan Collins? Take your hat off, son. Absolutely outstanding individual effort. Here goes Collins, and he sends it straight through the middle. France have it. They're going to kick early here. England need to react. Corsell is after it. If he gets the bounce, he's he going does. to score. He, he will over. score. Try for Nicola Corsell. Wraps up his hat trick. And it might be the try that wins the Fasole Kildi trophy. The kick over the top. And the pace from Corsell. Try France, who lead by five with less than six to play. There's not much between them. I think they've both made huge contributions to this French side. Yeah, well, we may have a, a split decision as France looking to wrap things up. And they have the man who got their opening try of the match has got probably the last one. Danny Denouillieri has got the try. France celebrations begin. The world champions yep. will regain the Fasole Kielty trophy. Oh, the players working their way forward. A warm ovation from everyone at Medway Park. No one has left the arena. It's the home of England Wheelchair Rugby League. And I'm sure those that are back will be back again next season. As Gilles Clausel lifts off the Fasole Kielty Trophy. The world champions have beaten the European champions. And the celebrations really do begin in earnest. A tough week for everyone involved for another huge step forward for the sport of wheelchair rugby league.